10. Just before the Senate turns its full attention to the impeachment trial, they passed one of President Trump's top priorities, the revised North American Free Trade Agreement. Thanks for choosing KTSM 9 News at 10. I'm Natasha Paloma. Daniel is off tonight. The United States-Mexico-Canada agreement could keep the momentum going for the job growth we've seen here in the borderland. The vote passed 89 to 10. The House passed the bill in December, so with the Senate approval, it now goes to the president's desk for his signature. New tonight, Borderplex Alliance CEO John Varela says the deal could bring the region more opportunities in all industries. Uncertainty is the enemy of private sector investment, uh, job growth, and optimization of economic development. And with congressional ratification today of the USMCA, the air of uncertainty has been eliminated. And I'm optimistic that we'll see a new and fresh round of private sector and significant private sector investment here in the borderplex region. Varela went on to say there's still work to be done at the regional ports of entry in order to keep up with the growth in transportation between both countries. A mother is in jail after multiple agencies rescued four children she kidnapped and took to Mexico. 